taking the bus. We are gonna take the boat bus mm -hmm. to do one stop because we just want to go on the water. <laughs> well, there's boat bus. It combined is both bus and boat. It doesn't change. Yeah. So there's the boat bus stop. Wait, let's literally, go. there's a stop. Oh. It's not here yet. Hang on. You know, maybe that is the bus boat. Emma and Mama left me here. I guess I'll have to get that right boat. Oh, hi, Emma. Looking at the wrong boat. Hi, Mama. I'm trying to get views over here. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, boat, you got this, you got this. Oh, that's how it stays. It connects, it has a hook that connects over here. Mmm, that's smart. So, this is pretty slow. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, the door's open. Cosmic room, and this is like this is, I guess, the first one. Oh my gosh, you have to go through there. Okay. Go. Oh my gosh, whoa! Oh, it's so hot. Wow. It's a permanent exhibition. And the colors re represent the Nordic, Nordic atmosphere. They're kind of colder colors. It kind of wants you to escape in nature. What? This is some hot nature. This is hot, yes. <laughs> well, it's, it's under the sun, eh? We are on one of the many bridges that you can cross here in Copenhagen. Many. Look, this one has the division between where the people walk and where the bikes go. If you go on this side, you're probably going to get hit by a bike because you shouldn't be on this side. But you should be on that side. We go this side. No, cock. I'm so happy that you get it. <laughs> this is the way. <laughs> He's still not listening. He's still trying to get run over by a bike. Yeah. Oh, look how colorful. Everybody's sunbathing today. It's a beautiful day here in Copenhagen. Copenhagen. You know, they really need a beach here. <laughs> they have them. Not in this spot, but... No one likes to go on the beach. I mean, come on, look at this, Zoe. There's the stairs, so you can go in the water. They say that the water here in this harbor is the cleanest. In the world? In the, or at least in Europe, so... What? <laughs> you can, without any problem, go swimming. That's what people do. Okay, hey, let's keep on crossing go. the bridge. <laughs> You slowed it down. <laughs> oh, that's a cool bike. So now we are on the Nivan Canal, which it's a man-made canal. canal. Basically, the merchants built houses all along. They're all very, very nice. They're all colorful. They would moor their ships right along the canal. This was also the area where emigrants that they were moving Wait, to the US. It's emigrants. Emigrants. <laughs> that were moving to the US would come here to buy their tickets. They started opening taverns and places where people could sleep while they waited and for their tickets. This is probably one of the most touristy places to visit here because of all the pretty buildings. They're all so colorful. What? Breaking news, Mama's camera is dead. Someone killed it. The Was it you? Wait, <laughs> you have you have grease on your shirt. No, I don't. <gasps> and look at this knife I found on you. <gasps> Emma! I sentenced you to be kicked in the ocean. Uh, no, 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 no. Yes. Okay, you push me in and vice versa. <laughs> this is reflections in common. Oh, this is... <laughs> I am split for ways. Uh, yeah, look. There's me and me and a mirror and a mirror and a mirror and a mirror going That's on forever. So cool. That's so cool. They have so many of these uh, exhibitions just in the city so you can uh, interact with them. And then look at this. This is in case one of the giants that we are still on the search for, the trolls that are here in uh, Copenhagen, he needs it because he doesn't know how to swim, right? Yeah. Now we are going to the Guinness World Record Museum where apparently you can try to break a few Guinness World Records too. Let's go check it out. The heaviest man in the world weighed 483 kilos. What is your own weight? Let's see if I can weigh more than this guy. 64 kilos. 
<laughs> My gosh, skinniest waist? That's a skinny waist. She can put a headphone around her waist. I just found out. This famous soccer player, his legs have insurance, and their insurance is 132 is. million. Look, this guy's mustache. His <laughs> mustache is 27 million. You should insure your hair. Why do you want to insure your hair? <laughs> Last few. Seriously, last few? There's like 20. Look, we have the W and the R. Come on. Fine, we'll do when we come back. Yeah. Is the most tallest and favorite building in the whole world. It was made in the year I was born. Burj Khalifa. Look at that. All these buildings are just tiny, is, short people. Where <laughs> is the Burj Khalifa? In Dubai, the Emirates. Good job, Cosimo. Look at that tiny building. Short building. Short building. Short building. Short. Can't oh, be did dead. you go on the top? Yeah, I went on the tippity. No, I didn't go on the tippity top. I went like here. Did you know, guys, the Burj Khalifa's elevator was like 190 miles? Like it goes like a car. Denmark has the Guinness World Records for having the oldest flag. My favorite Guinness World Records! It's dated 1219. This guy has been eating glass and metal since he was nine years old. Now there is a Scary Extra section. Not yeah. scary. Well, Cosimo is not coming because he thinks it's scary. It's called the Mystic Exploratory. Exploratory. And we're gonna check it out. Me and Emma are the brave ones. Bye. Are you sure you don't wanna come? Yeah. I'm you sure. still can get it focused. I'm not gonna sleep tonight. Step inside. Whoa! Wait. This is actually cool. It's a bunch of me! Oh my god. Oh. This is so strange. Oh, Emma, look at this one. <laughs> Sit across the table with your friends and spin the bottom of a spooky surprise. What's a surprise? Whoa! <laughs> I see myself in this video. If you have the Copenhagen card or you just, oh, you can pay for it too, but there this there is not a very scary thing. No. There are games, people said? It was cool. Do people say? I yeah, see. we got like electrocuted. What? It was fun. <laughs> oh, that actually kind of sounds cool. Oh, you didn't. Do you want to go in? No, no. He doesn't want to go by himself. You guys. No. This is the longest pedestrian shopping street in Europe. You can notice that it's long. Look at all the people. We keep on going and there keep on being no cars. It just never ends. And there's so many shops. We weren't even planning on coming here. We just happened to walk in. Cousin was walking by himself. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Tivoli. In one Copenhagen. Of, which is one of the oh, oldest hello. amusement parks in the world. It's the third oldest. And it's right in the heart of the city. So because we have the Copenhagen card, it was included. So we decided to have another fun day in town. Are you excited, Luca? Yeah. How excited? I'm really excited. <laughs> okay, so, so we came in. Look at that. This is all. The, there is wait, like wait, over wait. 30 rides. Wait. Tip for who comes to Tivoli Gardens with a Copenhagen who card. Who actually pays on doing the rides. Yes. If you want to do the rides, you have to pay. What is free is the access to the gardens. Cool. Second Luca found out he couldn't go on a ride without a bracelet and you have to pay for that. He was like, I'm going on a ride. So the standard rate is about $37, which I guess it's okay, but I honestly thought we were, we had it included. So now we're gonna try to go on a ride. I don't know if it's scary. We'll see it's very right, soon. Right
have no clue what we're doing here. Ew. Trying to get a bunch of points, Mama. Boop. Whoa. Mama, you're so not you good at this stuff. Yeah, I've never been to a park before. <laughs> are these things shooting? Oh, I did it. Yes, I did it. I'm gonna hit it. No. Okay. It makes you think of Disney. Please, well, let me get one. It's a dragon. Oh. Oh. Oh, look at those eyes. Oh Hi. no, it's gonna shoot. Oh no, it doesn't shoot water. Whoa. This one goes way up, and because we can't bring nothing loose on it, we're showing Pretend you. Pretend were those two people, yeah. two things right there. Pretend <laughs> that's us, but it isn't. I'm like, yeah, we have to go do that. Imagine if somebody lost his shoe right now. Yeah. Yeah, they just, they, <laughs> they got their shoe and after, whoop, and after they drop it, they're like, oh my no, gosh. my shoe! Okay, this is the roller coaster that Cosimo really wants to do. What? No. It's called a demon, so, I mean, totally. No, just, just bum it. Don't tell him. Just cut this all part out. Pretend that's us. And we have a potential oh, yeah, that's totally videographer. Uh-huh, sure. Oh, here it comes! Oh, they're doing the back They made the tree move. Come on, let's go. This is something your dad would do. Yeah, yeah I definitely would do this. Cosimo, did you know that Walt Disney came here and was inspired by Tivoli to create Disney World? So it doesn't surprise me. This is a fairy tale ride. We'll see what it's all about. Oh look, you get to go in a little box. Oh, and bounces too hard. You know she'll come to a set. A lovely butterfly helps them believe it's away. Away from Mother Toad and her ugly son. Many adventures lie ahead. To see the world. She came to love a human. These are little cars. I got to go by myself. Oh, there's Emma! Oh, I lost Emma. So I technically should drive, but I don't need to. Bye, Emma! And there's Cosimo and Luca! Hi, guys! Hi! Hi, Emma! Bye, Emma! Whee! Oh, there comes our boat, Emma. New number 11. Yay! Hi! We are in the famous river why are of Tivoli. Emma, why are you not? Why are we in a river? Emma I doesn't it was a know. Lake. Oh, did I say river? I mean Lake Tivoli. <laughs> there is Japan, China, everything over here. There is a bridge, and there's Cosimo and Luca. I can't see you.
I see why it's called Tivoli Garden because there's all this area which is gardens, there's restaurants, cafes, just pretty walkways. I think, guys, now I'm venting this, but our, our Denmarkian subscribers tell me, I think it was first gardens, then the guy came up with doing it in a park. Well, the guy that came up with the idea, it was 1840 something. He said that if people were having fun because it's an amusement park, they were not talking about politics. And so this was a great way of distracting people from the politics happening at the time. We but you had to pay. I guess. <laughs> so um, how is that attracting from politics? You gotta earn money, people. Oh, Tivoli, this guy Tivoli, I gotta talk to him. Well, this guy, the name was not Tivoli though. The person that invented it, created well, Whatever, the, the person who invented it, I wanna talk to you. But you know. Is he dead? Oh. Probably. So look at the playground though. This area is really cute. I mean, Emma and Luca are on uh, this ride, which means a lot of workout for them. I don't think we're ever gonna get out of here. Nope. See, it's not all about the amusement park. It's also about just being in a pretty environment. After this whole day of fun here at Tivoli, we are gonna go on a hot air balloon to end our uh, day. Yeah, a fake hot air balloon, no, right, Luca? Don't say no, that. No, 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 a real guy. no, 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 a real hot air balloon. We're flying right now. Oh yeah, guys, so we've been on a real one. Let's just skip to that video very fast. Are you excited? Yeah! <laughs> but I want to show you the view because we went on some rides that were high above, but we couldn't bring anything, so we couldn't show you Copenhagen from here. It's so cool to think that we are in the middle of the city. Maybe some are wondering, how do they do all these things during the winter with cold snow? They're closed. They open in April and close in September. So you come here only in the summer and the spring. Okay, here we are. Look at that. Look at that one. That's my favorite. Yeah, we did that one. Or they, they make this whole place heated. They put heating everywhere. Sure. So if it snows, all the snow melts. Yeah, I agree. Hi. Wait, how'd you get there? I squished it. Excited to see you, Luca? Yeah. <laughs> hey, move the oven. Oh, this guy is bumpy! 